Hey, this is Vlad with the Virgin here at MWC 2013. And this device in front of me you'll be familiar with is a Droid DNA for Verizon. It's a 5 inch 1080p phone. Uh, came out at the, at the end of last year and it is one of the highest spec phones we've had. And this thing right alongside it today is the NVIDIA Phoenix. Now, the Phoenix is essentially NVIDIA's answer to the Droid DNA because it's a 5 inch 1080p phone also quad core, uh, but powered by the Tegra 4i, the brand new chip. Um, the Tegra 4i is kind of a lower power version of the Tegra 4. Uh, it isn't Cortex-A15, but it does come with an integrated LTE modem. Uh, so essentially what NVIDIA is trying to show us here, this is a reference device. Uh, it's one that OEMs can essentially pick up and build themselves. Uh, it's a blueprint that, that you can take and NVIDIA is trying to take these specs that we saw with the Droid DNA which was really high end when it first came out and turn them mainstream. Uh, what uh, the CEO has told us, uh, Jensen Kwan, is that uh, he expects this kind of thing to be a mainstream device uh, within a year's time. What we wanted to do was spend a bit of time playing a couple of games on this just to see uh, what sort of performance it can deliver. All right, so. Really and truly, I have no idea which one of these guys I'm supposed to be, but that's not really the point of this demonstration. Uh, we're trying to get an idea for the graphical uh, quality. And it does look like a, an attractive game. There were a lot of uh, blood splatters and uh, we've got sw sweat dripping off b both boxes and things like that. Um, I believe I'm the guy on the right because I had to tap to try and survive. I've been knocked out. So this game is Riptide GP2, uh, which has been optimized for Tegra 4. Uh, it comes with higher textures on the buildings, more in the way of visual effects. And the frame rate isn't perfectly smooth, but then again, this is First silicon, as NVIDIA tells us, so we can't expect it to be perfect all around. But it should give us an idea for the sort of thing we can expect to see in the future. Okay, so that's a quick first look at NVIDIA's Phoenix development device. Um, this is still just a blueprint, essentially. It's a prototype to give manufacturers an idea for what they can do with the new Tegra 4i chip uh, and where they can take things in the future.